those of you that are actually willing and well wishers wants to give and help to support this orphanage help wherever you are you can give something and support Ministry Kenya Outreach Tidings Community Projects Outreach Team initiates and implements community projects to benefit poor communities in the Republic of Kenya. One of the ways we would like to raise funds for this project is farming. One cow is given to one widow or a pastor and that particular pastor or a widow is supposed to be keeping one to three children so this cow it will produce milk and this milk can be used for the family this same cow will be able to produce a bull and when that bull is grown we sell it and we make money part of the milk will be sold and we can have money at the end of the month when we sell the milk so the, the cow project will be very, very important for the kids. Driving is not a priority here given to the poor roads and infrastructures. The bicycle therefore come in handy. It is a say here in Africa that the, the van can never be full. The transport problem because of shortage of vans. You can see there is a need for building a hospital because the hospitals are very far and the means of transport are not easy and it may be one in a very wide area. In this hospital, almost like um, all the children we see, they have malaria and that is from the clinical features. Every day we see like 20 cases of malaria. Like in a week we lose five children because of malaria. And you can see right now, they are still getting their water from down the river at the same water. They use it for washing their clothes. The cows go there to drink the same water. And that's how we catch up the diseases and all sorts of sicknesses that come up from water. If we can make and dig a well, it will serve both community and our children. Every child every day eat a meal on the school and sometimes twice, but it does not promise two meals in a day. They only eat one meal and most of it is porridge in the day and then in the evening is not known for them. Even if you look at what they're using as classes, it's an iron sheet place and when it's hot they really can sweat and they start sleeping. So it's not conducive actually the environment right now where they are is not very conducive. So this is what is needed for these children because they are really suffering. What we have in mind is to build a structure that can actually uh, accommodate both boarding. The kids that have got no father, no mother can stay here and those that can still go back to the Acadians can still come and be uh, accommodated on the same ground. So we, we have a plan to build a storage kind of a building that down here is classes and upstairs is accommodation and staff offices and anything else that can help the school and a food store. 
This is the ground we are wishing to build the orphan school. The neighbors are wishing to move, but it's just a matter of having the money that we may be able to buy a bigger land so that we can give to, to them and make us have a bigger place to build this uh, orphanage school. So we are praying to the well-wishers and uh, the people come and help us put up this orphanage school to enable us continue with what we are doing. This is our second school in a place called Lukuyani. And uh, this, this is a school that has just started uh, two, two years ago, but it's not growing at all. The school is situated on the rocks. So we want to make this place a school of orphan, and we want to, to have it more like um, actually a place of rescue, like resource center and everything. It's a big, big land. We can make use of it. We need help for toilet. The whole school uses this place. This is the, the one that we want to fix. If someone steps in there, he will fall down. Definitely will bury you alive if you go into this kind of a toilet. There is a hole down there, and if you see, you can cry. But this thing is very emergent because you cannot live in a place without a toilet. Thank you very much. Uh, those of you willing and well-wishers, wherever you are, you can give something and support. <laughs>